Hello guys, in this video we will edit the template in advance. So let's switch back to Blogger Template Designer. So let's click advance. We already done background adjust widths and layout. So in advance, there are a list of options here. You can edit the template color. For example, page text. You can choose a different font if you want. Impact. So as you see, the text are changes to impact font. So I don't like it. Times Roman. I don't like it too. I think the Arial is good for me like that or you can clear advanced change to page text if you want to back to default I think this text is good so you can change the color I think black is fine and let's go to background you can able it to change the background if you don't have set the background image so the changes are not seen because you already have a background image so let's clear advanced change the background links you can change the links through here this color link correspond to this link color if you want to change just choose here color but I think this color is good and let's go to blog title blog title is called spawn to this area so you can change the font to impact I think this is fine so we stick to here and you can change the color here and let's go to blog description you can change the color too but I think black is fine for now because we change this template in the future video text tab it's the same option tab background you can change the tab background if you like date header Date header correspond to this text. Post title. I think we change this post title for example. So let's change the color to this blue color. So as you see to the body, the color text are changed. The post title are changed. So let's switch to post background. You can choose a suggested color here. You can able to see the yes it changed but I don't like it so let's clear and uh, next gadget color you can also change the gadget color here if you want gadget text also you can change gadget link you can change the gadget link to for this example I choose this dark blue or dark brown as you see in this link they change but I don't want it so let's clear this and the sidebar background also are changeable you can change the color to brown but I don't want it so let's revert back and the last two are the mobile button color. You can see this changes in the desktop version, but you can able to see in the mobile version. I mean mobile device. So the last one are add CSS. You can add here a custom CSS if, if you have a knowledge in CSS. You can put through here. So after the changes you like, so let's click to apply to blog.
and below this page.